Hello guys, today I'm going to review the Iridium browser. It is a Chromium based free and open source browser. And it's like browser secure your privacy. That's it. You review it and see how it goes with browsers. So it says transparency will give a whole host attire transparent for Git because privacy is based and enhancements for strict security to provide the maximum level of security without compromising compatibility, deployability, duration, and so on. Hmm. First, when I installed the browser, I thought that it looks so much like Google Chrome. Like, see, like if you go to Brave, you know, it's also based on Chrome. Like, like it doesn't look like Google Chrome. Like, it looks like Chrome, but not exactly full like Chrome. Like, this is looks full copycat of Google Chrome. Hmm, interesting. It's free and open source. I like feel we can we can trust this code also. So. Maybe Google Browser for those people who just love Google Chrome's interface but are concerned about its privacy issues. Maybe it's a good browser for them and it's full it full it focuses full of security in their website. Like it's full of the privacy they are saying about security. So, hmm. so uh, let's explore the settings. So settings it just looks exactly like Google Chrome. See privacy and security. Safe browsing. They say that safe browsing will send some data to Google. So, so to keep that in mind. Enhanced protection also says this one will standard protection does just need data to Google, but enhanced protection will send. This exactly looking like Chrome. It's default so it is want. But I love like Dr. Go or Stoppage. I love Dr. Go or Stoppage. I want Quant. I also love Brave Search as well. I don't want Quant. I think it's a good privacy search engine, but I see. Brave. Let's see about browser. Different 22. Plus 22. We can store extensions to the Chrome Web Store. It looks nice. Let's add some extensions like what can I say? Roblox Origin. Very important. It's loading. No, why it takes time to even load this page? It's based on Chromium, right? It's like origin yeah it's so what problem does this have like it's not even letting me to it's taking so much time to load <laughs> oh man that's bad oh, oh there we go finally let's try to add it and see chrome Extension and there we go. So, yeah, adding extensions works. It's good. It's loading speed, so yeah, it's. Works very well. It blocks third party cookies by default. It's good. But still, there's no tracking, cracker blocking, like blocking scripts or something like that. It's very basic. So you have to install some third party add ons to increase you know, its privacy. I mean, it's not privacy badger as well. It blocks third party cookies, but it doesn't block third party scripts. So, mm, something. What is it? It takes so much time to load. <sighs> Why does the Chrome Web Store take so much time to load?
add to Chrome, add to your browser, and uh, there you go. So that that's good. Yep, that's like a block. So, yeah, yes. so I think this is a great browser for those guys who love Google Chrome's interface. Just want a browser that's full of everything exactly like Google Chrome. So maybe it's a right good browser for those kind of guys. So yeah, guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Okay, guys. Bye.